Hello everyone. In this video, we shall discuss example number seven point six of class nine science physics chapter seven motion. A car accelerates uniformly from eighteen kilometers per hour to thirty six kilometers per hour in five seconds. Calculate the acceleration and the distance covered by the car in that time. So accelerates means it changes its velocity uniformly, and initial velocity is given as eighteen kilometers per hour, and final velocity is thirty six kilometers per hour. So we will just draw a rough sketch of that. This is the car moving initially. It's eighteen kilometer per hour. and then it moves some distance and then this is 36 kilometers per hour and to cover this distance it takes 5 seconds we need to find the acceleration and this distance traveled by the car so initial velocity u is 18 kilometers per hour we need to convert this to meters per Second, that is the standard unit. So kilometer, one kilometer is thousand meter, and one hour is equal to sixty minutes or three thousand six hundred seconds. This you must know. Okay, so we will do eighteen times thousand, converting kilometers to meter, and per hour, so three thousand six hundred. Cancel the zeros. Two fives are ten. Two eighteens are thirty-six. So five over eighteen. When we cancel this two, and then eighteen and eighteen cancels out, right? So we get one. So this is five meters per second. This is the velocity. Now for the final velocity, instead of multiplying by thousand by three thousand six hundred, what we can do is. We can just multiply thirty-six kilometers per hour by five over eighteen. So thirty-six into five by eighteen. Eighteen ones are eighteen. Eighteen twos are thirty-six. Two fives are ten. So ten meters per second. This is our u, and this is our v. Time is already in standard unit, which is five seconds. So first we will find the acceleration the formula for acceleration is a acceleration is v minus u by t v is 10 minus 5 divided by 5 so that equals to 5 by 5 or we can say 1 and the unit for acceleration is meter per second square so that is the first part of the problem the second question is we need to find the distance covered by the car so for the distance we will use the formula distance s is equal to ut plus half a t square so this formula we are going to use we know u is 5 into time is also 5 Plus one half acceleration is one. We just found out into time given as five seconds, so five squared. Now simplify this. Five into five is twenty-five plus half into one is half, and this is five fives are twenty-five. So this will be twenty-five divided by two. Now when you do twenty-five divided by two, this is very easy division. You can do yourself. So this would be. Twelve point five. Okay, twenty-five divided by two is twelve point five. So twenty-five plus twelve point five, and the unit is meters. Distance is measured in meters here. So meters. So final answer would be twenty-five plus twelve is thirty-seven point five meter. So this is our distance travelled by the car from. This point here till here. Okay, so we will just write this. The acceleration of the car is one meters per second, and the distance covered is thirty-seven point five meter. So that is the solution for example seven point six. 
see you all in the next video thank you